No, Farrah don't need therapy. She need a brain surgery on her head. Well, any daughter that talk to their mama like that, I don't see why y'all allow her to talk that way. That would have been me not holding the camera. I'll throw a camera at her face from talking to her mama like that. And tell her how wrong she is for sitting there talking to her mama like that. I blame y'all, MTB. I am no longer blaming Farrah for this. After seven seasons and this shit still going on, I see y'all trying to help. But y'all ain't gonna get nothing through the Pharaoh ass. Y'all see right now she hard headed, ain't gonna learn. Y'all ain't gonna teach her nothing. I don't give a damn how much therapy y'all feeding her, how much money y'all feeding these therapists. Farrah ain't gonna never learn. She don't wanna forget about stuff. She don't wanna move the fuck on. She did bestly wanna fuck with her mama anyway she can. That blue arguing with her own camera, making her mama look dumb. She down for the cause. I don't see how y'all sit there and allow y'all to record that scene, how the way she talked to her mama. If it was me holding the camera and I see her, I take that camera out my damn shoulders and throw it in her face and tell her, girl, you need to learn to talk to your mama better than that. How did your mama would die today? And that was your last words to your mama, the way you bitching on your mama in front of the camera. How would you really feel for the rest of your life knowing that that was your last words you said to your mama, cussing off for no damn reason, for no reason at all? How would you really feel? Hold up, wait a minute. What kind of effort you making with your mama? You mean every chance you get you fussing with her? Well, not fussing. You making her look worse and worse on camera every chance you get. You call that working with your mother? Because that's all we see. You bitching at your mama every time. Your mama can't do no suggestion. Your mama can't ask you no course without you dropping down her damn throat. If you call that happening, okay then, Farrah, we get it. Oh, you love your mom. How so? You love her so much you wouldn't embarrass her? Farrah gone with the fuckery. Gone with that fuckery. You don't love your mom. Cause you love your mom. You'll get over your insecurities from over when you was a child. You'll get over that shit, move on, put a period. You don't love your mom. You just love embarrassing her on TV. That's why you love her at embarrassing her on TV. And I don't know why she sit there and allow you to do it, but she allow you to do it. I guess you give her a bit cut of the embarrassing her on TV moment, huh? Is it just me, or do Farrah look like a Bambi? Look like Bambi in this episode, where, where um, where um, Farrah Mama put talk, got this new boyfriend talking to Farrah. Do Farrah look like Bambi to y'all, or that's just me? Cause I swear she said she was going for the Bambi look. She nailed it. I mean, perfectly. Got the glassy eyes like a deer and all. Got the nose like one that's not of a mouth of hers. She got she got the perfect Bambi doing. She looked just like Bambi. Oh God! Now Farrah meeting up with her supposed to be friend Simon. She won't say boyfriend. Now he getting her ass. Y'all ain't doing it enough. Still, she didn't did this shit for seven years. Then two seasons with you, Simon. Now you want to get in her ass after the seven seasons. By the way, she talked to people and rude and disrespectful. Y'all didn't let this hoe open a damn, a damn yoga shop now for she can boss other people around. I blame all of y'all for letting this helper get around with this shit for seven seasons. And I don't feel sorry for you neither, Simon. Cause she run over you just as much as she run over her mama. You see how she treats you the same way she treat her mama. So I don't got no sympathy for you neither. The buckaroo. Wait, 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 wait a minute. So Simon trying to warn Farrah that that man she dating is a con other than that. Him, I'm gonna get got it. Ooh. Farrah, and you really love your mama. You'll take care of that. But we know you're a little sad bitch anyway. That we know you ain't going to take care of this. So I don't know why we looking for you for support on this. Because we know we ain't going to get no support from your tired ass. You probably going to sit there and probably laugh at your mama getting used by somebody. So I ain't, I ain't expecting you to do nothing. What have you done for us lately besides bitch at your mama for seven seasons? So, I see you sitting back laughing at your mama and her heartache. 
Let's be honest and let's be real here. Pharaoh face offends people, but we learned to excuse that. It's that mouth of hers that she need to be punched in. That fits already a fitness and that nose too. So Dr. Jean, she is offensive already. That mouth just automatically offensive by itself. Dr. Jean, Farrah ain't gonna listen to you. She gonna continue to talk to her mama like a doll. She ain't gonna work on no communication skills. Anytime the mama do try to hold a conversation, okay, ma'am, okay, ma'am, mom, you know I don't know this, okay, ma'am, get out of my house, ma'am. She ain't gonna communicate with her mama. Yeah, she did wasting y'all time paying y'all money. I done told y'all this a two-side show. Farrah is paying her mama for her to sit there and talk to her mama like this. This ain't nothing new to me. I been knew that Farrah was paying her damn mama to talk to her. That's why she talked to her the dog. That's why she talked to her mama like that, like a dog. Cause Farrah paying her bills. Farrah giving her a cut of this money for her to embarrass her mama like this. And this working on the communicating skills shit. Y'all can forget about Farrah learning communicating skills. I didn't told y'all she already offensive. Farrah is not going to change. Y'all just going to have to operate on her. I done told y'all that. Farrah ain't changing for no amount of money, no person, no therapy, or no type of bill. Farrah going to stay Farrah 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Congratulations, Macy. You finally got married. I'm happy for you. You and your new um, husband. Anyway, though, y'all, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later. Bye.